Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Arfia and in today's video I'm going to be talking about my very first time live DJing at my local GOT event called Infected. first when did I start DJing I actually started DJing a long time ago I actually uh, was taught how to DJ using CDs and then I did mix a few times at smaller events but not really big things and then I just didn't really continue with it because there were too many god DJs at the time now recently I picked it up again because I was getting frustrated at the music that was getting played at the parties I attended and I just wanted to see if I could still do it myself so in December 2017, January 2018 is when I started my DJ journey, the way it has continued up to now. I actually bought the DJ laptop that I use and the DJ software, which is called Traktor, uh, which is personally my favorite software. I have also tried Virtual DJ and I did not enjoy it. I also tried Recordbox, but I felt more of a connection to Traktor as a DJ software. Anyhow, I have a specific laptop that I use only for live streams and for DJing. So that's a laptop that I put all of my music on. So all of my legal copies of CDs and all of my digital downloads that are purchased through several websites such as Bandcamp. Bandcamp is actually the main one that I use. Um, there's another website which I can't find the name of right now but I will include somewhere around here. Um, it is a little bit more expensive than Bandcamp but they have a lot of other things as well. And around that period is also when I created my Mixcloud to motivate myself to create mixes. My goal is to upload at least four mixes every year. I haven't uploaded uploaded one this year yet but I am working on one so I'm really excited for that um, and the thing that I personally like to do in my mixes is mix old and new music so I started going out when I was 17 18 so I have been around for almost 10 years in the god scene which seems like a lot honestly um, but it feels like yesterday so all of those songs that I really love from back then up to now I still want to mix uh, because a lot of the local DJs right now they only mix very obscure things or very new things so I wanted to find the middle line and also have of course new releases in it so that's the thing that I want to do I mix the music that I would dance to that I would love to go out to that doesn't get played as much anymore uh, both old songs and newer songs that have been released so basically that's how I DJ. Um, I mix old and new and I try to incorporate it into a very danceable set because for me when I go out dancing is what I enjoy doing most so I want to allow the people to dance to my music too. Now to give you a little bit of insight about Infected Party, it is one of my favorite parties here in Belgium. It has been around for over seven years. It used to be a lot more frequent than it is right now. It is my personal favorite party because of the music mainly, because it is catered towards more electronical god scene. There are more god parties here in Belgium, but most of them are either very broad music wise or very specific towards wave, which I personally do not enjoy dancing to too much. But Infected is really awesome and I was super happy when they asked me to mix at their March edition, which was absolutely insane. Now, a few of you have been asking me how do you prepare for a mix set. I knew beforehand that my first set would be one hour and that my last set would be until the end. So I knew I would start at three and the end of the evening is at five. So I did plan for two hours and I'm glad I did. So what did I do is I made short lists. So my first set was my more active set and I will be putting the track lists in the description of the video so you know which songs I played. Um, and I actually had to start with a request song because it was someone's birthday, so I played Combi Cried's Happy Birthday. Um, that was not a song that I chose myself, it is something that I had to start my set with. But anyhow, I just continued along the flow. I kept my first set really active. So I had a short list of about 40 to 50 songs for my first set, which was the more active set uh, with the more actually danceable music that is more EBM electronic music. Um, and then the second set, I actually mixed a lot more of different styles. I mixed synth pop into it. I even took music that is not specifically considered God, etc. So I really had fun in my second set specifically. The first one I did enjoy a lot as well, but my second one was my favorite. And my shortlist for my second set was actually just all music that I really enjoyed. I think I had 
100 to 150 tracks in my second shortlist and all of the tracks from the first set were also in the second one if there were songs that I really enjoy and I maybe didn't mix my first one so that I could mix them in my second one. Now for my software Traktor is actually really easy to use. I have a small DJ console of which I will put the info somewhere around here. It is very 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 easy to navigate through everything and I can use my small control panel to do anything I need into my system into Traktor. So unless I don't want to use a song that is already in my shortlist, I don't have to do anything. So if it is not in my shortlist, I have to type manually on my laptop, which is not always the most practical way, but it still works and it's not really too bothersome. Now, I did really enjoy mixing Ed Infected. Um, I'm not sure what I can tell you more about it. I wish I could have danced to my own set, that would have been nice. But for your enjoyment, I have a few pictures of me while mixing, which I will put somewhere here while I'm talking to you guys. And there is also a video of the first three songs, I believe, of my set. Uh, so the person who edited the video actually used the songs that I mixed together. It's not my mix, he just mixed them together himself. Uh, but so that you get an idea of what I did and what Infected looks like. It was specifically a cyber edition. I was wearing cyber locks, but I had to take them out because my hair was just too massive to fit into the DJ boot. Plus it was not practical for dancing. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed this rambly video about my first time mixing DJing at Infected. I hope I will be able to DJ a lot more in the future. I had a really great time. I really enjoyed myself and I just wish there were more events here in Belgium. I will be making one mix set during the month of April. It's gonna be my birthday mix set, so it's gonna be all of my favorite songs right now. So if you still have any questions at all, feel free to ask them in the comment section. In the description box, you will find the track list of the songs I played at Infected, as well as a link to my mix cloud so you can hear what I do and how my mixes sound, etc. And for those of you who are trying to get into DJing, I would highly recommend using Traktor or Virtual DJ or another software to get started. Uh, be sure that you practice a lot because practice makes perfect. And if you ever would DJ at an event, don't panic too much. It's the music that counts, not the way you mix it. And that's the main thing that I find personally at events is that the song choice is more important than the actual mixing, which sounds bad. But it's actually true. Like, I would prefer a, a start and stop situation of two good songs than someone really trying to mix songs into each other and it being two little shit songs that you can't even dance to. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I make new videos every week and I would love to have you here for every single one of them. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye!